Hello and welcome to this video tutorial by TakshilaOnline.com. In next few minutes, you will learn a shortcut technique to solve a particular type of profit and loss questions in just a fraction of seconds. Before starting the video, I assume that you are aware about the basic terminology of profit and loss type of question like cost price, selling price, profit percentage, loss percentage, and you know how to calculate profit percentage. Profit percentage equal to profit divided by cost price to 100. Similarly, loss percentage equal to loss divided by cost price into 100 and you will also aware that both profit percentage and loss percentage are calculated with reference to cost price only let's take an example siddhan sold two bikes for rupees 50000 each on one he gains 14% and on the other he loses 14% find his profit or loss percentage in whole transaction let me provide you ready-made solution of this question to save some time there could be various ways to solve this question Siddhan sold two bikes for rupees 50,000 each on one his gain is 14 percent another his loss is 14 percent if you want to find out the loss or profit in the whole transaction then you must know cost price of whole transaction and selling price of whole transaction selling price is given 50,000 each so selling price would be 1 lakh in the case 1 selling price is 50,000 and profit is 14 percent we already know that percentage profit can be calculated as selling price minus cost price divided by cost price so i put the values here 14 selling price 15,000 and i will calculate cost price in the first tension as 14,859 similarly in the case 2 this time there is a loss of 14 percent loss can be calculated as cost price minus selling price divided by cost price so if i put the values i will get cost price in the second case is this much now if i talk about the whole tension cost price of whole tension will be this much selling price of whole tension is this much it is clear here that cost price is greater than selling price that means in the whole tension there is a loss how will i calculate my loss in whole tension loss equal to cost price minus selling price divided by cost price so it will come to as 1.96 percentage of loss you might have noticed that this question involves majorly three calculations that two up to two decimal digits and it's obviously the quite time consuming process in real exam you don't have that much luxury of time so now we will see how we can solve this question in just fraction of second this is the trick to solve these kind of questions very quickly let's see if two items are sold that in the earlier case two bikes were sold one at profit and another at loss and profit percentage is equal to loss percentage then there will always be loss of x square by 100 percent in the whole transaction if i talk about the previous case there were two bikes two bikes were sold at 50,000 each and there was loss of 14% at 1 and gain of 14% in the second transaction. So in this transaction there will be a loss rather than doing 3 calculations up to 2 decimal digit I can simply find out there would be loss of x square by 100 here x equal to 14 so loss will be 14 into 14 divided by 100 196 by 100 that is 1.96% so within fraction of second without doing much calculation you can simply find out that there will be loss of 1.96% in the whole transaction let's take a couple of more examples to clear the concept in better way the same question i repeat with slightly different figures, Siddhar sold two bikes this time for rupees 10,000 each. On one he gains 14% and on the another he loses 14%. You have to find the profit or loss in the whole tension. I solved this question for you like earlier. Selling price will be 10,000 plus 10,000 equal to 20,000. Case 1, 10,000 selling price, profit 14%. Cost price will be 8,771.93. Case 2, Selling price 10,000, loss 14%. So I will calculate cost price in the second case as this. 
total cost price this and i can notice cp is higher than sp there will be a loss of 1.96 percentage i would like to attract your attention to one thing here in the previous question the selling price was 50000 in this question selling price was 10000 still the loss is same 1.96 percentage in the both the cases so learning of this question is if two items are sold one at profit and another at loss and profit percentage is equal to loss percentage then always will be loss of x square and and this loss x square by 100 is independent of selling price so it doesn't matter if selling price is 10,000 or it's 50,000 or it's 50 rupees loss will be same 1.96 percentage as long as profit percentage and selling percentage are 14 percent so let's take one more example rocky selling two pen drives at same price makes a profit of 10 percent on one and loss of 10 percent on another then what would be his profit percentage or loss from the previous concept you can easily find out the loss will be x square by 100 percentage where x equal to 10 and in this case loss will be 10 square by 100 equal to 1 percentage you might have noticed you are not given here the selling price as i discussed in the previous question if profit percentage and loss percentage are same then total loss will be independent of selling price so to find out the loss percentage you don't even need selling price hope it's clear let's take one more example very quickly it will make your concept crystal clear same question rocky is still selling parent drive slightly different figures in this case if rocky by selling to pen drive at rupees 200 each selling price is given makes a profit of 10 percent on one pen drive and loss of 10 percent on another then he makes no profit and no loss he makes a profit of rupees 2 he suffers a loss of rupees 2 he suffers a loss of rupees 4 you already know in this case there will be a loss so option a is rejected option b is rejected you have two choices now he suffers a loss of rupees 2 or suffers a loss of rupees 4 as i already told you how much will be his loss 10 square by 100 equal to 1 percentage 1 percent of whole transaction and in this case whole transaction value will be 200 he sold the first pen drive and again 200 he sold second pen drive so total cost of full transaction will be 400 200 plus 200 equal to 400 1 percent of 400 equal to 4 so your answer should be option d he suffers a loss of rupees 4 my idea of discussing this question was to tell you that total loss is calculated on whole transaction not a single transaction hope this is clear so i believe this concept is clear to you i hope you enjoyed this session don't forget to subscribe our channel by clicking on subscribe button you can also visit takshilaonline.com for all type of aptitude exams you may also download our upsc apps thank you